What's up everyone, it's your man Busy. Today we are going with the top 5 prison scenes in movies, but this is for superhero movies specifically. And there have been plenty of prison scenes, but this is, I guess you could call me biased, I don't know. This is, in my opinion, the, the scenes that I like specifically, and it's the top 5, so. The, a lot of these scenes are brilliant, and I hope you guys enjoy them. And let's get started. What the hell are you? Busy. At number five, we have the Batman interrogation scene from Batman The Dark Knight. If we're gonna play games, mm -hmm. I'm gonna need a cup of coffee. Ah. The scene is not really a prison fight as much as an interrogation scene, obviously. Yeah, they're kind of I, they're doing a big interrogation scene and this scene is one of my favorites because we get to see batman and joker go head to head in some of the iconic scenes and this is just amazing we get to see batman actually show i guess the dark side of him because i guess joker is actually pushing him to the edge so the thing about joker in my eyes he does have a power and his power is like getting in people's heads i guess so i mean like we get to see like the severe mental side of him while he's giggling while he's getting his ass kicked and i mean obviously that would piss me off as well so i mean joker's doing his finest work and he's just continuing to badger and bother the dark knight and it's just crazy batman loses control so badly jim gordon he jim gordon wanted to trust batman but at this point he can't it's just amazing when you get to see Jim Gordon try to rush in and try to break up everything. But Batman is just, he's just pushed over the edge at this point. At number four, we have another Batman scene. This is the prison fight from Batman Begins. This is like how we start off the movie. And honestly, it's another one of my favorite scenes because it's obviously in a foreign country. And it's, it just gives us like a good idea on who Batman really is and like it, it it's just honestly an exciting and kind of a funny scene because after he ends up kicking all like their asses you know <laughs> the the guards are pulling him back and their uh, protection from who well from that for them and it's like I don't know it's just a, a very exciting scene because it really gets to show like like the Batman character and like, everyone be saying, oh yeah, well, he needs his gadgets, he needs his gadgets. But, I mean, he's perfectly fine against these dangerous people. Like, these aren't just, like, everyday robbers and little criminals. These are full-on, like, like, these are full-on, like, inmates. Like, I don't know. Um, And it, it it's just a brilliantly choreographed. I, I just, I love it all. Um, And, yeah, but... Yeah, this is at number four, and this is the ba last Batman scene, and it's it's just a very exciting scene, and he, he thinks that they're trying to pull him back due to them attacking him, but they're like, no, protection for them, not for you. <laughs> it's, it's just crazy. At number three, we have the very, very exciting prison fight scene from Watchmen, and it's, like I said, a very exciting scene. <laughs> Where's my face? Throughout this scene, we get to see a little bit of Rorschach, but that's besides the point. We get to see a whole lot of action. We get, throughout the scene, we get to see Night Owl, Rorschach, Jupiter, it, it, I don't know. It's all these prison, prison inmates faced off against them, and it's just a brilliant show of camera angles, just... A bunch of different things we get to see like i said before this is honestly brilliantly choreographed um they they just have a big trust for each other and honestly this is the movie but you get to see the ones that she doesn't take care of he takes care of it's just i don't know this when i saw the scene i just got very excited because of how much work must have been put into it and how how much they got done and it was it's just uh uh great showcase of um fighting and like what a superhero is you know what i mean and it's just very exciting rorschach his scene is less of a superhero type thing um if you guys seen the movie you guys know what he does he um murders a midget um 
That's all I'm gonna say. If you guys are very int really interested, look the movie up. It's actually really good. Um, and that's all I'm really gonna say. But the different moves that they do, all the moves that they do, it's not just kick punch. It's not kick punch. Everything's just mixed up, and it's just I love it. And it's just another one of my favorite scenes. So this is number three. At number two, we have Deadpool two in the prison fight scene at the icebox, and <laughs> this scene is another exciting scene, because we get to see a lot of future tech by Cable, we get to see the whole prison go to go to hell due to the, all the inmates um, being released from their cells, and it's, uh, like I said in the other fight scenes, this is brilliantly choreographed, we get to see, it's like a great introduction to Cable for, um, like, this fight scene in I don't even know how else to put it, but it's just a brilliant way to say it. Um, we get to see Wade Wilson somewhat trying to protect the kid, but also just, you know, he's just trying to figure out what's going on. And it's Deadpool's just one of my favorite characters. He's just, it's like the movie's hilarious, end of, end of story. And it's just a brilliant way to introduce Cable and Deadpool face to face because they have a, a a bunch of interactions in the comments they're like teammates at points and it's just awesome to see it because um at one point cable looks deadpool straight in the eyes and says who are you what are you because i mean he didn't expect a challenge from anybody there and it was i think a big surprise to him that he actually had somebody to go one-on-one -on -one with and and it's just amazing to see this whole fight scene because yeah cable cable just the, the stuff that Cable has, like, obviously it's all future tech and everything, so it's just amazing to see it all, and then we get to get some funny comments in about, like, oh, what's the future like, oh, dubstep, all this, and it's just, it's just a very, very, very funny interaction that we get between them, and we get Fire Fist, um, thinking that Wade's looking out for him, but this is just, he, yeah, it's just a very, very interesting scene, um, while the whole fight scene's going on, Wade Wade's just giving out some weird comments like, "Oh, you're so dark. You must be from the the DC universe." It's just very, very funny, and um, it's another one of my favorite scenes. Didn't make number one, but it made number two, and it was a good debate, I guess. But yeah, and it it's just a brilliant way to show the good the interaction between the two, and yeah, I love it. Cell or we will open fire. Oh, yeah. At number one, we have Guardians of the Galaxy in that whole prison scene. And yeah, it's not like a full on prison scene because it's, I guess, it's not really. It's a sci fi prison scene. But honestly, that does not matter at this point. This scene is by one of my, it's just my favorite, like, we get to see, the, it's like the first time the Guardians are actually working together, and it's just, honestly, it's just amazing how we, how they put it in, like I said before, choreographed, it's just brilliantly, it's, it's just, I love it all, we get to see Drax, um, helping them, and Drax really didn't, he, he wasn't really friendly at first, and this is like the first, like the, the one scene, like the one movie we get to actually see a badass. And yeah. it I just love it. And we get to see Gamora, she ends up helping him up. And R Rocket's just trying to figure out how to get out of there. And we get we get a bunch of shots of them together and it's just it, it's just amazing. You know what I mean? Um it, it's like I said, it's just one of my favorite scenes. As well as comedic comedic and different things i don't know we get some jokes i guess throughout the whole thing too when rocket's trying to tell peter quill what he needs he ends up telling him he needs a prosthetic leg and yeah peter ends up getting it for them it's just it's just really funny it's like the whole prison against them and it we get to see a lot of action and it, it it's just it's just very great and then they end up getting out together as a team and we get to see them standing as a team and it the reason I think I love it so much is because Guardians is a team, so Guardians of the Galaxy is a, is a team, so seeing them work together and 
do things together is just like what makes the movie the movie and we get this yeah it's just it's just amazing and yeah that's that's <laughs> i have i'm a loss of words that's how good the, the scene was it's it was executed perfectly in my eyes Alright, I see you man busy, I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, help me man, I'm trying to go places. And I want to drop more entertaining videos for you guys. Um, have any suggestions, just drop below in the comments, it's your man busy. Peace.